So hello guys, hope you are great. So Thapar University has released the second round cut off details recently, and they released it after around I think five days or so. They were going to release on 19th, but they released due to extension of fee payment and all that. So but finally they released, and we will be discussing the cut offs and should you take that branch or not. And I will also be telling that what cut offs might go down in the next round of counseling or. Or they will remain same as it is. So if you're interested, please continue watching. So guys, basically you can just see that this is the first round counseling cut off, and this is the second round counseling cut off. You can also see the dates, and you can just see that mainly let's discuss about computer branches first. So it was 98.667, and it got reduced to 98. As I told, I told it won't go below 98, but it's around 98 only, which is I think great. And talking about COE, it was 96.667, it went to 96, which is also just a small change, but that's how it changes. So it was, and I'm talking about outside Punjab right now, so so we will be looking at Punjab cutoffs in a while, but if you are from outside Punjab, you can just refer that. And I'm talking about computer science and business systems, its cutoff got reduced quite a bit compared to COBC or COE, it was 97.33 and it got up to 96.667. So these were the main cutoffs talking about computer branches and, and COSC is basically computer science at Deravasi campus. So it's also around 96 only and if you want to ask that should we take Deravasi campus CO SE or should we take COE at Thapur University Patiala campus. So I just made a video about Deravasi campus as well. I took help from one of my friend who was there at Deravasi campus and he recently got shifted to Thapur University after two years. He's in CSC so you can just see that if you want to refer. And these were the main computer branches cutoffs and you can just see electrical branches cutoffs as well. It's around 95.667, 94.667. So apart from computer branches, there has been a significant difference in cutoffs for other branches because of, course, because of course computer branches are main and yes most of the people would prefer them only. So these were the main cutoffs and if you are and if you want to ask that how much lower it would go in the next round of counseling that is in third round of counseling. So basically last year what happened that most of the cutoffs were just similar talking about computer branches if i talk about computer science branches so i was in punjab so basically i was in punjab and basically first round cutoff was 95.667 for punjab csc and in second round it went to around 95.33 and in third round also it was around 95.33 only so there was no change in cutoffs of computer science in third round in punjab quota so you can just refer that as well and basically I would like to say that don't expect that it would go somewhat lower also so so there are high chances that mostly this is the cutoff for computer science and it won't be changing most probably because most of the people would take admission in these branches and that's why and that's why there won't be any significant change in these cutoffs there might be a diff slight difference in coe cutoffs or cos or cobs but you should not expect there will be any much great difference so if you are aiming that you just want computer science only and not any other branch and you are expecting that the cutoff will go up to 97 or 96 so it won't be happening sorry and you can just expect that computer branches cutoffs will be this only will be this only and maybe there might be a slight change but most probably their cutoffs might not change so this was for outside Punjab. Now let's go for Punjab students as well. Okay, so these are cutoffs for Punjab students for the second round. You can just see that computer science cutoff was 96.33 and it went to 96, which is almost similar to last year. Last year this was the final cutoff, I believe. No, it was 95.33. So this year cutoff is quite high. And talking about COE, so it went as expected, it went to around 89.667 and it was 92 earlier. So compared to previous years, the cutoffs are quite higher this year, maybe because of the pattern change of the boards, although no one of you gave the boards. And that's it. And you can just see other cutoffs as well. So 
you can just see that there is a massive difference in cutoffs for Punjab and outside Punjab students. So being a Punjab student is quite a big deal if you want to take admission in Thabo University. So it might be very easy for you to get your desired branch because there is a quite there are there is a lot of difference in cutoffs compared to Punjab and outside Punjab. And and yeah, that's it. Talking about COE, so many of you might be thinking that will it go to 89 because many of you might be getting around this so there are chances but there are not much high chances like i said that last year cutoffs almost remained similar only in second and third rounds uh, talking i'm talking about the computer science and basically computer branches cutoffs so there is a very high chance that computer science cutoff will be 96 only in next round also and talking about coe it might go to 89.5 or basically it might go up to 89 but i don't think so it will be reducing a lot you can just expect that talking about computer branches there won't be much great difference there might be difference in other branches because people can choose they want to take admission or not but computer branches are main so that's what people aim for basically that's why the cutoffs might not go much down in computer science or basically computer branches so i'm just saying that the csc cutoff will be remaining 96 only most probably there might be some change in coe it might go up to 90 sorry 89.5 and since cobs cutoff might also go somewhat lower but not much and cosc which is computer science and data bus you can just see there is a difference and basically it, it depends how much people pay the fees and how much people accept the seat that they are getting and it's a private college so it's very expensive that's why some people have to opt out and again if you have some doubts that you should take uh, Patiala campus or Dehrabasi campus so I have made a video you can just refer and yeah that's it for the cutoffs for computer branches and even even if you are getting electrical branches so they are not much great as computer branches but yes they are they are fine and they are good i would say compared to other branches they are good and and mechanical branches and mechanical branch is also good i would say because many of the mechanical people have taken packages similar to computer science students and that's it because most of the people will be getting computer science jobs or you can just say jobs related to computer science industry or you can just say it industry only so that's the reason that branch doesn't matter these days but yes it does matter when you are entering college you can just upgrade your branch if you want after coming to college and if you want to see the procedure i have made a video for that as well how you can upgrade your branch during your first year and after your first year on the basis of your cgp or basically your and basically there is a special test which you can give which occurs in december so you can just choose what you want to do so that's it regarding the cutoffs again i'm saying that computer science cutoffs might not change a lot in the next round of counseling so if you're getting a good branch so you should just take it if you want to just take admission here only and you don't have any other options in terms of any good government college or any good branch at some other private college so you can just choose to take admission and yeah, that's it so you can just see that they will be doing the next round of basically the third round of counseling on 6 september 2021 and this time also you can just expect if it delays so it will be delayed because of the delay in fee payment deadline only and yeah that's it you can just see other details so and some of you might be having some difficulty in finding this pdf so if you're not able to find i will be pasting its link in the description as well you can just download it from there and these are the main criteria which I discussed earlier also these are the details and and basically if you don't want to take admission and you want to take the refund of the fees that you just submitted you might get a withdrawal option or you can just say refund option in your dashboard in the profile that you might have created during while filling the admission form so there might be an option for withdrawal you can just fill the form and submit to get the refund and you might not receive refund just in a bit but it might take two three months so i have not much details about it but you can just inquire the institute for that if you want to 
so if you want to take any information regarding the refund so you can just contact them as well although i know they don't just pick up phone calls many times it used to happen at our time also last year but yes that's, that's how it's gonna be and just but yeah that's it so you just have to deal with it so if you just live near patiala you can just visit the campus anytime if you want to just get an information you can just visit the campus and just take an information if you are not able to reach them on phone so yeah that's it for the video and if you have any other doubts you can just comment down below and you can just dm me on insta as well by following and, and i will try to reply there as well and if you want any live session like you want to get any details about the institute and all that so i might host a live session as well so you can so you can just comment down that as well and make sure you subscribe the channel for getting more videos like this and for getting more videos related to college and how you can just grow yourself or basically all the skills that you might be needing and basically if you want to get all the and basically if you want to get some idea and knowledge about skills and what should you do in college and all that so do subscribe for that and do like the video as well and you can just share the video with your friends if they are having difficulty in choosing what they are getting so i will see in the next video till then just all the best and to the ones who have got admission or those who have got their desired branch i would like to congratulate them and i would like to welcome them to thabar so we would meet if the campus opens though there is a new so we would meet if the campus opens though there is a new news that they have extended the campus stay for third and fourth years earlier it was around 15th october only so now they have extended up to 29th october because people wanted diwali, diwali holidays so they just extended their stay so our stay got reduced we might be going now in november or december maybe basically there is no basically there is no information regarding when they will call us but they have extended the stay of seniors our seniors so so this might change the time when they will be opening campus for you and for us as well so yeah this is not much great news but it's okay but it's okay it's just college and you should just be ready for everything so these things happen a lot in college so you should be ready so that's it for the video and i'll see you in the next video thank you very much